Strowman? <laughs> Miss Strowman, can you hear me? Welcome back to Why, Team Movies. Today I will explain a drama romance film released in the year 2011. Before starting the film, make sure to subscribe and like this video. Who is it really? Jansky. The movie begins with a wealthy man named Virgil. He runs an auction house and he was an auctioneer. He was very punctual with his time and he had a minimal French circle because he had a disease called OC, and that's why he doesn't meet many people and he always wears gloves on his hands. Virgil received a call from a girl named Claire. She asked him to come to her house because she has many antique paintings, and she wants to sell them. At first, he refuses to come there. However, when Claire insists, he agrees the following day. Virgil is at an auction, and a man named Billy buys a painting worth $20,000. Meanwhile, the people in the auction don't know that Billy is a friend of Virgil. He had asked him to buy the painting because he couldn't buy it himself because of the rules, and that's why Billy bought the painting. After some time, Billy gives the painting to Virgil. At that moment, Virgil tells Billy that if someone picks up a paintbrush that doesn't make him a painter. When Billy hears that, he gets slightly offended because he is a painter. Later in the day, Virgil goes to Claire's house and she is not present there. That's why he gets angry and comes back home after some time. Virgil received a call from Claire and she apologized for not being at home, and again, she asked him to come to her house. Virgil replies to her that he doesn't want to do any deal, and when Claire hears that, she starts crying and tells him she had an accident. That's why she wasn't home, and when he comes next time, she will be at home and she won't disappoint him again. Virgil agrees to meet her after that. We notice something strange about Virgil. He loves to collect paintings and all of his paintings are of girls. He had a lot of knowledge about paintings. However, he only collects paintings of beautiful girls and feels attracted to them. The next day, Virgil again goes to meet. Moreover, at the gate, one of Claire's servants talks to him. The servant takes him inside and gives him a tour of the mansion. Virgil sees some magnificent old antiques, and while looking at the antiques, Virgil sees some old mechanical parts. When no one is watching him, he steals them. After that, he leaves. The next day, Virgil went to his friend named Robert. He runs a mechanical shop, and when he looked at the old mechanical parts, he understood that it was. However, he couldn't understand what they were, so he asked Virgil to bring some more parts so he could combine the men, and see what it would make after that. When Virgil goes home, he receives a call from Claire and he gets angry at her and tells her why she did not meet a man, a deal between them. However, she doesn't give him a clear reason and asks him to continue their deal the following morning. Virgil went to the mansion with his assistants to collect the antiques, and at that moment he received a call from Claire he instantly understood that she was in the house, and that's why he started following her voice. And while talking, they start fighting. Virgil leaves everything and goes home. However, he was curious about Claire and wanted to know more about her. That's why Virgil gave some money to her servant so he can get some information from him. However, the servant tells him he doesn't know who Claire is because she's always hiding in the later, just like whenever Virgil wants to buy a painting, he asks Billy to buy it. They do the same at the auction. Meanwhile, Billy was distracted and someone else won the bid for the painting. Billy wanted to buy, and because of that, Virgil couldn't get the painting he wanted. He gets furious at Billy. Later in the day, Virgil went to meet Robert and he told him that the mechanical parts were from the 18th century and that he could make a machine from the parts. When Virgil hears that, he gets. And now he was more curious to know about the mansion in Claire, and that's why he went to the cafe in front of Claire's house to get some information about her. However, he doesn't get anything. After some days, Claire approaches Virgil and his assistant tells him that she wants to meet him. The next day, Virgil meets Claire at her mansion. He talks to her and they confirm their deal again, and when Virgil leaves, he sees some mechanical parts lying on the floor. He picks them up and gives them to his friend. Later one day while talking to Claire, Virgil finds out that she has a phobia, and that's why she doesn't go out of her house, and she never met anyone because she is scared of the presence of other people. She stays alone at home, and whenever she's talking to someone, she talks to them from a closed door. Meanwhile, Virgil tries to look inside the room and he can't see anything. That's why he tries to break the door. At the time, Claire tells him not to break the door. After that, they started dealing regularly. Virgil goes to the mansion and confirms the deal with Claire, and one day when he confirms his deal with her and starts leaving, he pretends to go out and close the door and come back inside and stand behind a statue so that he can see her. After a while, Claire thought Virgil had left the mansion, so she came out of her room. Virgil looks at her and he sees her for the first time, and he is completely in love with her and finds her beautiful instantly. Virgil was attracted. Later in the day, Virgil meets his friend Robert and tells him everything about Claire and Robert gives him some tips on how to talk and behave with Claire. 
After some days, Virgil meets Claire on her birthday, so he buys flowers for her. Meanwhile, Claire is angry at him because her antique paintings are being sold at a low price, and she thinks that Virgil is not doing his work properly. When Virgil hears that, he gets angry at her, breaks his deals, and then leaves at night. Virgil received a call from Claire and she apologized to her. She convinces him to work with her again and Virgil agrees. After some days, Virgil wants to see Claire, so when he's coming out of the mansion, he again pretends that he's come out and silently stands behind a statue. And when Claire comes out of her room, Virgil's phone falls, and that's why Claire gets scared. She starts screaming and goes to her room. Meanwhile, Virgil quickly comes out of the mansion. At that moment, he received a call from Claire. She tells him that there is someone in her mansion who she needs. Moreover, Virgil realizes he made a mistake and goes inside the mansion, and talks to Claire for her comfort. He tells her that he is inside the mansion and there is no one else. After hearing that, she gets furious at him and tells him to go out of her mansion. Virgil gets upset and starts leaving. However, when Virgil is about to leave, Claire comes out of her room and tells him to stop for the first time. Claire comes out of her room to meet, and when he looks at her, he couldn't understand anything because he is unmarried, and that's why he has no idea how to talk to women and how to treat them slowly with time. He takes advice from his friend Robert and buys new dresses and gifts for Claire, and she likes all the gifts. One day Virgil goes out to bring something for Claire from the cafe in front of her house and in the cafe he sees a short-sighted woman who is always there, and that's why he feels a little strange. However, the woman was mathematical. She had many students and people would come to solve their doubts and she would help everyone later as time slowly, Claire started liking Virgil and he called him handsome and kissed him on his cheek. One day at dinner, Virgil tells Robert that he should secretly hide behind a statue and looks at Claire the following day. When Robert sees Claire's beauty, he is completely shocked. After some days, Robert's girlfriend meets Virgil and tells him that Robert doesn't give her time these days, and it seems like he's attracted to some other. While talking, she tells him that you always talk about Claire, and when Virgil hears that, he gets outraged, he thought that Robert had started loving Claire, and that's why the next time Robert came to meet him, he gave him his salary and fired him from his job. The following morning, Virgil goes to meet Claire, and for the first time, she invites him to her room. Meanwhile, he sees some beautiful paintings and antiques while talking. They become close and start, and they have started loving each other. Whenever Virgil comes to meet her, he takes mechanical parts with him, and with the help of all those mechanical parts, Virgil makes a machine like a robot. It was working, however, he had the new mechanical parts that he brought. He couldn't put them together. He had fired Robert from his job, and that's why he gave him the job back and apologized for his behavior. And after that, Robert gives him some tips to impress Claire. One day Virgil brings lunch for Claire and he searches for her in the whole house and can't find them. He searched for her everywhere, but he still couldn't find her, and he started thinking that she might have left. After that, he talks to everyone, Claire's servants and his friends. He asked all of them, why did she leave? Moreover, Virgil gets frustrated. He even forgot that one of his significant auctions was on that day. At that moment, Virgil receives a call from his assistant, and when he goes to the auction, he can't focus. He says everything wrongly, and everyone starts laughing. After that, when Virgil sits alone in his room, he remembers that Claire once told him about his secret room, and maybe she is in that room. Virgil goes to that section with a servant, and finally, he finds her in the room. She was feeling despondent, so she went to that room, and later Claire told him the reason for her sadness. She says that she had a boyfriend and she loved him a lot, and one day he died in a car accident, and since then, her condition has deteriorated and that's why she started living in the mansion, hiding from him. Claire was a